All right. Superman and the Watchmen. All right. Who watches the Watchmen? See, these are all the Watchmen heads. As there are seven of them. Patrolling space. And there are 12 of like disciples. All right. All right, my videos, you need to have an open mind. Everything that you have been taught and learned, you need to forget about it when you watch my videos. Because all my videos, they all combine together. The Bible videos combine together, but these combine together. All right, Superman and the Watchmen. All right, this is what I want to show you, though. Alright, okay, Superman, and there's the doctor. Oh, oh, what's up, Doc? There's the doctor there. Doc? What's up, Doc? Alright. What do you see right here? See the spirit? See the hat? See how he's lifting... This is the brain. See the brain? As Da Vinci's photo. See, but this is backwards. Boom! See? But you can't see it, can you? Bet you the drawer didn't know about it. As spirit. See? And you flip it around. The olive branches. See his face? There's the olives. But this is the dude. See his big hat? This represents the brain, as Da Vinci drew. But see, he's looking back. See his nose? He's looking back. And, and these things are getting eaten. So he's trying to hurry up so he makes a superhero. As it doesn't say anywhere about that character. This is a drawing. See? Alright. So Superman. Fights. The robot. Alright. As, as Dak. <laughs> Alright. We got the most important part, and this is Nibiru, too. All right, this is the most important part. All right, page seventeen. So Superman fights, keeps fighting this thing, but look at. All right, so Superman, he's fighting the robot. The robot takes off. So Superman jumps after him. So. And I don't think a world under their rule would be a particular pleasant place. Host below us. His name is Host. A concentration of structures. So when he gets, keeps going closer to him, inside the... Okay, it looks like a... Looks like, see, but that's his head. See? So when he keeps going closer inside here, he sees cities. Alright. His name is Host. Alright. And he goes, Host observed below us a concentration of structures. Confirmed. This is Superman. Confirmed. It is a city estimated population 1.5 million. Land there, Host. We shall begin our conquest from the point if we transfer into many bodies the super powered primitive will not be able to find us not until we are ready to take over this world concentration of structures see different bodies all right all right this is third phase from the from the moon this is yesterday I don't really believe in aliens, but they're 
are aliens, but they're just insects. Super giant black bulbous eyes, and it had a, <clears throat> it had a, these little yellow dots in it, and they flared up yellow, and uh, that really freaked me out. And so I'll try. As to I can it. see, he's like telling the truth. <laughs> this guy's so, embarrassed. When these little yellow dots flared up, it looked like his eyes were like these big, deep black uh, eyes that were streaky, and they flared up yellow. And when they did that, I was looking at me and my tent through its eyes. I felt like I was Troy the tent. I felt like I was Troy the pine tree. And I was like, I can feel all my pine needles on me. There's the and I felt every single rock. I felt every single leaf. In a big, giant, round, about 300-foot circle, I could feel every single leaf. Inside the dome. Crack in every rock completely easily. And I could see my face, and I could see the tent, and I could see through this thing's eyes. And 1983, that's that when I was born. And um, I got all of its memories, and uh, that's why I came up with... Uh, uh, these beings, I'm not trying to say there's See, no such thing as aliens, but these beings were, were tools. People they don't know what they're organic seeing. Robots so he's just, behind the right there, that is a Nazca figure of the Tree of Life. On Nazca, there's a huge tree. It's called the Tree of Life. Controlling them. And I there's the down the spikes, and there's the branches. Avatars, meaning uh, they're not necessarily important enough to keep around see but avatars on you know whatever they're doing um they clone and they and then it, it this was 20 trust me i never listened to this kind of crap i don't even believe in most of it because these people are confused why they clone or or why why there's the skateboarder types of aliens people think and I, you know, they're I suits because they're giants. I'm not really religious at all, but you hear in the Bible about giants. Nazca was drawn uh, well, by a giant. It is a wall. Were giants. I mean, there's no way that humans would be able to handle that. So they have uh, memories and understandings of, of why they clone or, or why, why there's so many different types of aliens, people think. And I, not aliens. You, know, you hear in the There's Bible, in I'm not really religious at all, but you hear in the Bible about giants and stuff, and I'm thinking, well, what if these beings or aliens were giants? I mean, there's no way that humans would be able to handle that. So Yeah, because they're so they big they can't come down to our world. world. So they, so they avatars, make a robots, bodies of themselves. Thing, uh, you know, like what they did with me. They did with me. <laughs> and, uh... This guy's so That's funny, <laughs> but he, he's talking about aliens and all this. But clone avatars, you, you know, you can't make this stuff up. You, there's something that you experience. Right. That, they, you know, they, yeah, they use they use a uh, lizard DNA and they use amphibian DNA because you know, like when you're seeing the movie, the Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. Well, when you travel in space, there's a lot of radiation. Radiation. Remember all my videos; they all add up. So that's why I'm calling them. Trying to explain them a secret to you guys, so you guys can listen. Or, or As only a few will. These guys from other dimensions. Uh, they're messing with time, space. They travel. No, they're messing with people's minds. It's a test. Life is a test. There wasn't testing involved. All right. Okay. So the point is. Okay, this will be part one of part two. I'll have a part two video. So anyway, all right, a plague broke out in the comic book, and this robot has two worlds in its eyes. See, and Superman's trying to fight it and can't beat it. So then he goes in, and he starts seeing two domed worlds, because Superman is a giant. Okay. So he sees two worlds like ours. I'm gonna get to this point on the next one, Sears. 
Alright. And then, so he just goes in. Confirmed. It is a city. Estimated population, 1.5 million. Land our host. We shall begin our conquest. This is his host. This is Superman, yellow. See, and then so Superman breaks through the bubble. And he lands in the city. So then there's two worlds right here. And these two worlds are competing with each other. Okay. Two. Let's see, and there's Nibiru. Right here. Oh, Clark's. It's a... Oh, Clark's. A pretty, resilient sort of guy. Lois... It was touch. It was in touch, and go for a while there. But the next time you see him, I'll sure he'll he'll be just fine. See, there's Nibiru during the time of all that happening. But this is what I want to show you. This is on on Nazca lines. But this is this is a very important thing because it's it's shown all over the world. Not, it's shown in America, it's shown in South America, it's shown in Africa. This is awesome, dude. This draw already know you even did this. <laughs> it's a, it's a <laughs> see, it's the spirit. As even when I draw, I put things upside down and I get the same thing. And I have the same guy. If you guys go on my Facebook, I have the same guy. Mirrored and made. Because everything that you have in your house, it, it's yours in spirit. See what I'm saying? Everything that you collect through your lifetime is yours in spirit. It's all branches. And this represents like the brain. And what it, what it does is, see, it's, it, he's holding this guy up. Like with his cloth. Because we're all held up in spirit. But this will be part two. And then this is what I want to show you, the mirror, Nibiru shining through. This is the most important part. This part, right here. Hey, what's up, Dak? This part right here. Boom. See? Page 17 has 17 lines as a Nazca star and glyph. I'll show you that on the next one. This is part one of two. Part two is going to blow your mind.